Hi, this is Slade McClendon with Sunbelt Fire. We are truly excited to share with you a new apparatus that we have available for immediate delivery. We're gonna start with the cab and walk all the way through the truck. First, I wanted to share with you, this is a two-door international. It has a Cummins 330 horsepower as well as an EVS 3000 transmission. This particular apparatus has a, an extended front bumper here. It has an enclosed storage for a front jump line and it's plumbed for an inch and a half line. A lot of people really love this feature to be able to pull up to the scene and have the apparatus. You can also tell this has air horns and the siren is built in. All of the lighting is federal signal lighting. And you can also tell on the top that it has an LED federal signal light bar. This is a two door cab, air ride seats right here, master connect power, and then it has all of the control gauges that are very accessible for the driver. It has a great windshield vi visibility, and you can see where the tank is situated right next to the death tank. It has the batter battery receptacle outlet right there for charging. Now I'm gonna walk you through the pump panel. This is a top mount pump panel. It has the gator grip sur surfaces here that meets and exceeds the NFPA walking surfaces. You can see that has great access into the pump. I'm gonna show you another angle, but both sides can allow you to work onto the, or inside the pump area. And you can see the discharges and the intake here with the bleeder valves. This is a Hell Q-Flow 1250 pump. This has a thousand gallon tank and it also has a 30 gallon foam cell. It has an Akron 95 GPM adductor and we're going to take a look up on top of the panel here. Now you're looking at what the pump operator would be looking at. He has a full 360 degree view of the scene. You can see all of the gauges right here in front of them. They're color coded for, the, for each of the gauges there showing you your, your foam adductor and the gauge here. And then it's just showing you your master gauges and it's, it's showing you your pump certification there to let you see that. And then the cl class one TPG right here. So water level gauge. You will also notice it is plumbed for a deck gun. So that there's a three inch line plumbed for the deck gun. And you're also gonna see lighting for the cross lays as well as the hose bed. You can also see these extended lights right here, these Pioneer Plus, incredibly bright, and they are on both sides of the pump panel and they can be raised up. Now I'd like to share with you about the body. E1 has always been known to build one of the toughest bodies in the entire industry. It builds it with an aluminum extruded design. We're also gonna show you the actual compartments here. This is an enormous compartmentation on both sides of the truck. So it has a 42 inch wide front compartment, a 56 inch wide over the wheel well, and then another 56 inch wide full depth in the rear. These are full depth on each side. You can also see there's SCBA bottle holders on this apparatus on both sides. I'm gonna give you a quick point that this has the adjustable shelving inside. And you can see the adductor line there and also just the full depth here. Take a quick snapshot here, showing you again another huge compartment here. You can also tell where all of the rub rails are scotch light on the inside, very reflective at nighttime. And then showing you the rear compartment. This is another compartment that is extremely large and has adjustable shelving. So all of these compartments have the roll up doors. Now we're taking a look at the back of the truck here. Again, they have really designed this truck to give you maximum storage capability. So in the rear here, this has a fixed shelf and you can see full height, full depth on the inside. You can also see the, the steps that are lit up at nighttime and it'll take you up to the rear that you can see a left rear discharge up at the top here and then the um, Chevron striping off of the rear. Again, extremely, um, well, well lit up at nighttime. Then we're going to show you the ladder storage and pike pole storage. So this has a great complement of your ladders. It has the 14 foot, 24 foot, and it has a backboard storage 
as well as your pipe holes and your attic ladder. That's all inside here. And then that you can see on both sides where there is hard suction available availability for the hard suction hose. Now I'm going to take you to the officer side of the apparatus to give you a quick snapshot. These are roll up doors. You can also tell these are full height compartments, same as the other side. They're not going to go as deep because of the enclosed ladder tunnels. You can see the SCBA bottle holders where you can put your bottles inside there. All of the wheels have wheel work on all sides. I'm also going to show you right now our, our pump area again and just show you if you ever had to have access in to work on the pumps to, to troubleshoot something or as you're doing your NFPA compliance pump testing each year you might need to have some some access inside E1 has designed this to be extremely user friendly for the firefighters I've already opened this side up each side as well as the front has full access inside so you can tell extremely user friendly and you do can tell how clean it is to be able to get inside to have access to this. All of, you can see many of the lines, how they are coming off with stainless steel piping where, where it's applicable in the high flex hose as well. Thank you again for allowing us to share with you one of our trucks that's available for immediate delivery. With this truck that we had the option for financing as well, that you might be interested in having a seven to a 12 year option out there. If you are, we'd be more than happy to be able to help talk to you about how that you can afford this investment for your fire department. We also would be happy to talk with you about how we would be delivering this and doing the familiarization for a new apparatus like this. If this is something that does not meet your immediate need, we have several more apparatus that we'd love to be able to talk to you for, for available for immediate delivery. And maybe it's something that you would like to design from ground up. Feel free to contact us as well. I just want to thank you again for what you do every day, putting your life on the line to protect your community. One of our commitments to this fire service is making sure we help those who save and protect lives. We consider it a huge privilege and an honor to be able to serve the greatest heroes of our country. Thank you for what you do and stay safe.